Hello and welcome to what might just be our final episode of a very hard solo. Um, I think I do want to kill the queen. I'm kind of excited to try it out. So whether or not the build is finished, we'll fight her today. I think made you guys wait long enough anyway for that. Um, so let's get on to it. She's going to be getting it today, that's for sure. And we'll see how many times it kills us in the process. But before that, we will do a bit of building first. And let's not walk outside too early. Let's maybe cook a bit of this while we're waiting for resting. Try not to burn it this time. And we had a good record of not burning food the whole playthrough until the start of, I think it was last episode. It was complete chaos and the bastards. Yeah interfered with my cooking you can say i think the interior of the house could use some more work I'm not sure um i want to finish off the apple stuff though today magic food sick aspect yeah we got enough just use those two for now pop an extra stand food if disaster strikes hello Almost done here. Yeah, repairing everything is going to be a pain in the ass. <clears throat> um, okay, so we're doing the tables here. I think we've run out of fine wood, possibly. Is that what happened? Yeah, no fine wood. All right. Um, I still wanted to continue the outdoor stuff and put a few of these on proper stands. This area looks good. This area looks great. This tower actually needs some finishing off. This wharf or whatever this is going to be needs a bit of work as well. Uh, the wall is not finished on this side. I still don't know what I'm putting there. Never even thought about that. Whoops. Oh, I've got fine wood in here. Nice. And pa. Oh my god, it's Christmas. Something needs to go there. Might take a break at some point and think about that. But we've got other areas we need to improve on first anyway. Pack away this stuff. Well, okay. So, that building is basically done. The roof is looking fantastic on it. The only thing left to do is... What? This blade of grass is a bit... Over the top. We should still have a stone cutter in the area. Yes, we do. We have like three apparently. Huh? But it's with this blade of grass, man. It's persistent. There we go. The damn rain, dude. Repair this a little bit. I've got to repair the whole fence. So freaking annoying. Um, this window could be better. Didn't we make it nicer on the other side? Yeah, we did. So we're gonna make it better on that side too. Can't be cutting corners here on the build. <clears throat> I've got to make a pathway right there. That's right. I was doing that last one. Uh, we'll build a little bit, and then we'll go farm some skills or something, skill levels, and then we'll build a bit more, and then about two hours in I want to fight the queen. 
approximately. No. Oh yeah, we have this part sticking up the top here. And it's gonna rain again. Holy cow, that's annoying. Just makes preparing anything pointless until we're just like done with the build and want to make a movie about it because it's just gonna keep raining and it's five to ten minutes work to repair everything, it's that bad. do to make this area look better. Dark wood on the edge could be one thing. We'll need tar. Um Starting to run out of tar. It's already a bit better. And we need like a little pathway going in here now. Oh, and it's not time. We can sleep and the rain will screw off. Oh, I think. You are wet. What's not breeding wolves? Can go investigate that. Uh, 
That's chickens. Oh, we're gonna fix up this building too, possibly. Upgrade it or whatever. Okay, we have four wolves here, five. Yes, a few got killed. Let's see about making more. I think I'll just do this normally. It's a weird looking roof otherwise, I don't like it. Why am I not picking up any of this? Nobody knows. Do it all the way across. Ah. Uh. Um. The amount of bastards that have attacked my walls, I only count it. A bit out of control, but still a little bit. Really should have the wood to finish this on my person. Would be silly if we did not. pieces in a bow and we need that 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 Okay, I'm gonna decorate this building a little bit, so let's get this stuff.
it's not much, but it's a little bit more exciting at least. And yeah, we're really, really running out of wood and tar. We can fix up this area too while we're at it. Add the grass back. And then decide if we want to keep the yellow flowers. I think they're okay. Let's see why not. Although, I like the dirt area a bit, so I might get rid of that one. Grass flats. Like the height difference is a bit much. Or add more vegetation if we want. Probably want to get rid of these random campfires when I am finalizing this area. My plan is I'll just build, 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 repair everything. Show you guys around in it, I guess. And then I'll record my short video and stuff on this offline. So I can use cheats like... Fix the environment and... Keep it from raining and stuff like that. Freeze time, play with the time of day, yeah, stuff like that. I'm not sure what's going on with this with glitch here, it's kind of annoying. Triggering OCD in me. Okay, um... Well, okay, we wanted a pathway here. Let's do that next. So... Probably goes down here somewhere, and we probably just slowly turn this. Remember to snap to bottom too. In fact, I might do that here even. Just to lower it a bit. This one's the lower side, so I'll snap it here. Or I can just do that. Yeah, it actually goes up a bit, but we're gonna fix that. We don't want the inkline increasing, we want it decreasing. In this kind of area. I'm not sure about this tree, the tree may have to go. But maybe it's fine. It's still within the garden bed or whatever. Stone cutter. This tree here is a bit stupid. I might. Yeah, come on. Didn't do too much damage. Actually, going it up here like that. That wouldn't be too awful. Uh, is uh, something funny? What in 
the world. Uh, can I help you? I sup, son. Hey, ha. What? What? You idiots never get old. I was on a swimming mission, dude. On an expedition to get me. This guy, we're breaking the hammer. Need a little bit of stone, we got stone, everything's fine. We're vibing. Stone, I even got fine wood. A whole seven fine wood from chopping that brick down. What a rip off. Damn bastard game. You get the chills. Oh shit, okay. Um crap. Oh snap. Okay. Whoa, two star. Okay. Okay, it's the elite squad of Arr -arr -arrs. Oh wow, and he's here too. Hello. I'm gonna fight them around until the you get the chills goes away so they don't respawn 10,000 times. Whoa, that's scary. Oh dear, that's that's scary. Oh snap. Holy cow. Oh god. That was with bone mass it took like that much of my health. Holy cow. Hey, help me. Help, 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 help. Get him, Gobbo. Oh, damn. You can chill out? Alright, nice. Just start killing them now. Hide them to the locks. Yo, know, help me, locks. Because I don't have stamina. Here we go. Get away from me, please. Dude, start fenderings are terrifying. They chopped that guy right up. Oh my gosh, okay. We've got a Lux over here that can help us. Oh dear. I think I've got most of them. Where's the cultist even going? Oh, well, you know what? Let's summon our minions to help. Hit this. Ah, <laughs> oh shit. 360. Damn. Don't mess with that guy. Where did that cultist go? I don't need him running around trashing my village. Where did he actually go? So I don't think they despawn. Crushed a fueling. Maybe the cultist did despawn, but this idiot is on the lurk. He's on the hunt, dude. Now he's after a skeeto. Oh, that skeeto got crushed. He's a strong boy. You don't mess with this guy.
Kinda rude if you ask me. I'm trying to prevent disasters from happening. If you don't mind. Where did that guy go? Oh. I guess he's just gone? Pretty sure enemies from events don't just despawn, but... No idea where that dude went. Oh, the night raids! Oh gosh. Thought he would have for sure staggered the Hey guys. I guess that start cultist just decided he doesn't need to exist anymore. Fair enough. As long as he's not running around my CBD on a murdering spree, I don't really care. We could put a bit more rubbery here, but maybe we clear our inventory and sleep first. Gahafa! Oh, who's clubbing my stuff now? <laughs> right, so yeah, what do we want to achieve today? Wow, run up to 90 almost, not bad. That could be up a bit. Bows are back to 50 somehow, nice. Pole arms 56. I want to get swords up. Swords are still 45. Still at 45. Ah. Uh, yeah, well. I'm going to be sorting the queen, is the thing. Oh, I've got to get to the queen, too. Well, I might just die. Oh, I don't know. Buildings are looking great. All the buildings look great. Except this one, oh yeah, missing bits here. But I, I can finally finish this off. Of course I have to move the forge here, then I have to repair everything. Oh, I don't know, I might leave this crap until last. But we could fix the stone floor up, I suppose, at the very least. Do that at the very least. Whoops. Actually, put wood down on this. I'm not sure this really does anything. Uh, 
Uh, I think the stone is okay. <clears throat> okay, let's put some of these here. Maybe two? Maybe two? Kind of add some excitement to this crappy wall here that doesn't have much going on. Spin the bushes around. Okay, I want vegetation here. Yeah, we'll do that first. How much stone? I'm holding a decent amount. Okay, great. Oh, you go there. You go there. We need to even the ground out here, actually. Everything should be around about this spot. Or slightly less. Yeah, maybe like that. Like that, yep. Now, uh this supposed to be this bumpy? I don't think so. Well, that's a massive hole that suddenly appeared here. What the heck? Yeah, it's a bit finicky, that's for sure. Let's do that and we'll add pavement in here. Then we'll re add a layer of grass about there. Not sure about this one right here though. There we go. That looks fine. Oh, I see what's going on. We require stones. We got the stones, it's okay. And now we want to get this guy under here. I think, to kind of make sure that gap is shut. Now this bit here, we want it around, yeah, this kind of level. And I want this a bit neater. Now I want to even this a bit. That looks fine. Looks fine to me. Okay. I'm not sure about the bonfire. I might make like a mini tower or something for it. Oops. I get a chest of supplies going. Thank you. Um.
looks kind of stupid. Or I could just do a stone lighthouse thing. Not exactly sure what to build exactly. Let's think. <laughs> It should be right on the coast here. I don't think it should be too big or complex, but a little bit of texture with wood as well as the stone would be kind of nice. There's your ladder to get up. Might actually keep the ladder. What if we integrated like dark wood into it or something? <laughs> Do I have tar? No, I don't have tar. Oh yes, I do. But I could put some dark wood on it like this and make it look a little less crappy.
I love that my character slightly moves just when I'm holding a hammer and turning the camera. It's really annoying, it can't just stay in place. Well, I found six black metal ore. Um, let's see. Do that, 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 which corner. It looks okay. I'm not sure what to do about this top part. I mean, you could put wood under there too. Doesn't look horrible in fairness. Uh, it's really not that bad. Just a bit of wood and stone plating. What about the stupid ladder though? The ladder's always gonna be ugly. Yeah, I might just roll with this. Does it look out of place? Not really, it's like a signal beacon. It does look a bit out of place, but I'm not sure what I can really do. I oh, probably don't need two bonfires, it was just there for convenience, but I'm kind of over those days now. What did we do the, to these windows? We didn't do a whole lot. We put window sills at the bottom, kind of buffed out the front wall a bit. It's all very nice. Angled pieces that are going all the way down to the bottom. Alright.
What did I do? Yeah, I have the X's and that bit coming up. Oh, for Shrek's sake. Uh, what do we do to the gate? Yeah. 
the same color. This is not very well aligned. Need to be shift snapped and moved more apart. Ideally. Same with this one. You don't snap it in like that, you shift place it and move it away so it can cover a larger area left and right. Now. So we've got a spare stone cutter, not really sure where that's gonna go. There for now. Whoa, what's going on here? Yeah. There's the random black forge that was somewhere. Can do the Diverga lantern thing a bit more. This place is looking pretty good inside. Could use a bit more stuff, but what I really need to do is I saw this in my picture. This lantern is ugly. Because it was clipping through the stone. We're gonna move it to a better spot. No, we don't want to do that. Well, uh, if I can get it inside. Oh, okay, that's not gonna work. All right, well, we just hang it in here yeah, as centered as possible. Oh, I see what's going on. These wood planks are not centered. They are, yeah, making this more difficult than it should be. If I shift snap them there, they kind of go into the ceiling. This part here is centered. Actually shift placing them so they pop out a little bit. Okay, so this is all grown. Could move this a bit, but I think it's mostly okay. I don't know. If I was gonna move it, maybe I'd move it here or something. But we can regrass this area because everything has grown beautifully. And then think about adding vegetation in a bit more. Maybe a bush here or something. Maybe not. Maybe a small bush. Be careful, the grass sticking out a bit much. Oh yeah, this is a natural grown one as well, this one right here, because it's smaller. That's awesome that we got some natural ones. These are natural ones as well, so we've incorporated natural grown ones as well. Preserved them from all the bull crap. But 
that all look good on my before after shot. You see the freaking bushes there before and still thereafter, as is the cloud berries. Yeah, I've already got some great ideas for a freaking video. It showed the before and after of this, like right here, and it's, like the small bushes and stuff, and the cloud berries will just be there the whole time. That'll look cool. Yeah, it's looking really good. Not sure what else I can really add here. Maybe a bush there. Bit of shrubbery. It's looking gorgeous though. Looking great. Probably put one of these in here. Maybe in the back. Yeah, we should have like a pathway to this staircase to start it, then we could do something here. You know, what about like a giant oak tree here or something? It's a good spot for some oak trees. Where's the oaks? Oh, really? That's funny, is it? Oh, okay. I have not touched an acorn the whole game. Wow. Okay. <laughs> What's funny? Oh, there he is. do it too hard apparently oh shit i got the locks coming as well uh oh all right well where's somewhere you won't destroy anything oh we have double mosquito here oh that's not good I need to do something about this double mosquito. It's a big hazard. Yeah, that takes care of one. That takes care of another. Now you. I love that that's a thing. If I stagger it, it turns around. And the impact damage breaks my bubble. See. It's really cool. This Aki does, does massive damage. It's so good. Yeah, 56 is nothing to sneeze about. That's like a 70% damage increase, but still. Ah, this one wants, wants it as well, does he? Whoops. Nobody knows what he's up to. Are you gonna fight me or are you gonna run away? You're gonna smash the bushes. Oh, you idiot. We've still got work on the wall to do. A suggestion one of my friends actually had was to like add vegetation against it. I think I might do that a bit. Maybe not right now because there's still going to be many more battles. But like once I'm finished with the playthrough, just before I make like a video on this place, 
freeze time essentially and just finish decorating stuff sensitive stuff and like repair everything and yeah 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 you get what I mean would be a nice touch oh I think anywhere else we want these big bastard bushes could put one here I go overboard with the... No. Yes. Maybe. I don't know, just fill out this area a bit more. Do want to go kill some stuff. Where is that forge? Yo. Where's the rogue forge? There it is. We want some iron as well. Got a fence to finish. Just tell me I've got 10 iron. Nope. Forward a little more. This is the last of the iron. I can still break stone cutters and stuff though. I think I should add like a little fence here though, was my thinking. Oh, I think it's nice. Ah, uh, no tar here, I didn't nails bronze now. Oh, got another one? Yeah. Yeah, the problem is I'm gonna have to do this again, probably. And then have to move the forge around in order to do that. How annoying. Let's get the grass up at least. going under the stone for us. I might even like do it like this. And then we can fix it a bit easily with this guy, that guy. That's okay. What I do is this, just slowly 
shave it a bit like that. Like that. And there's a little bit too much sticking at you. Like that, and we'd leave it like that. Pretty much. Right, Black Forge is not in range. It's coming together. We need a lantern here. Let's go around and oh, let's sleep. And let's go around and put a few more lanterns down. Shut up out there. 10k instances, baby. I think that iron can just go back in here. Get salad when we have an issue. Oh dear, we are running out of Ababova lanterns. Alright, well, this is what we can do. Need some vegetation here, that's for sure. Oh, I was gonna do oaks, right. Yeah, we need to. I might do this first because I need I need them to grow and they take a while to grow. So the sooner we do that, the better. So let's just um, 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 hold that thought for a bit until we get oaks in the ground. Yeah, I think I'll just put like oaks up there, maybe even like the bees or something. Would be a nice spot for that. But yeah, I need to go find oaks. Okay, so where are the meadows? Well, we have Hilda's Meadow. It's not very big. It's actually very tiny. What about Haldor? Haldor's pretty close to center. I'm sure if I run around spawn, I could find oaks. I mean, come on. Never touched an acorn. Unbelievable. Okay, dudes. I'm sure there's some, like, up here. Wherever there's open meadow, you have a pretty good chance of finding them, although I'm not finding any yet. How oh, is raspberries not back here? What the hell, dude? Yo! Piggy. Meh. Always accepting neck trophies if you guys have any. Ah, hello! Oh yeah, top up the fine wood supply as well while we do this. Two birds, one stone. Easy. Tommy's coming. Yes! Oh no, Tommy! Come back, tree! I think I'll need more than two, but I might try and get a little bit more just in case. 
because I might like plant it in the wrong spot or something and have to remove it or something so yeah Yes, hello, oak trees. There's one over there. A close black forest. Might still find a uh, oak tree though. Yeah, level this bastard up a bit. Runner's almost 90, hell's yeah. You do get a lot of run and jump levels just from building, running around in your own base. That's why those have gone up a lot this series. If I didn't die as much, there could be like 100 right now. So I lost like three levels on those when I died, sadly. coming for revenge. Well, he dodged. Holy shit, what a gamer. He dodged again, dude. Didn't dodge that one. Oak tree. Just want a couple more. Oh, we can grab raspberries. I think we're running out. Don't need leather. Probably should grab some raspberries. I can make like decorative Queen's Jam and stuff. Place raspberries on the tables. Yes, acorns. One acorn. Two acorns. That's alright. Pump, 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 pump. You ink a bunch of this fine wood, I think. Oh, really? Let me get this out. There was spawn. Spawn is right there. We're getting rained on. That's wonderful news. Tommy, it's raining.
Mushrooms, we don't need those for raspberries. Who else wants to get it? Do I need mushrooms? I need raspberries. Where are all the raspberries that were here on day one? This one. How many have I got? 13. That's not great, but it'll do. I've got like 20 or 18 raspberries growing in my house anyway. Let's get out of here. Is it raining in the plants too? Most likely is, or it's ultra fog. It's raining here too, it's just great. Yeah, so my iron's just gonna get smashed again. It's just fantastic. Oh, I really dislike the mechanic of the game. Got rotting in the rain, but. Can't really do much about it, can ya? No. Okay, yeah, plentiful raspberry bushes. I'm not gonna be using those. It's too cheaty. Or moddy, or whatever you wanna think of it. Yeah, like the oak at the top of the hill is quite a nice idea. I've no idea what the orientation of that'll look like, but. We can just have more birch on this side. A wagon of supplies which has been abandoned. We may have to re-chop and replant that thing there. We'll see. Where are my birches? Bro. I want the village to be as natural as possible. Even though I have planted everything, it's like only Putting bushes down and fixing what was destroyed. Probably adding a bit more though. Um, birch seeds, these guys, yes. And... I don't know, could add some of the uh, more fur trees. Small dead fur tree. Oh, that's a swamp one. Than if the normal ones. I mean, you know, consider putting some of these around. Might be nice. Like right here. Might be a nice little touch. Okay. Um. I don't think I need that one there. Should also have some sort of pathway here. Uh, we'll need to get iron for that one. Or some birch here. Maybe mix it in with the green birches. That is actually a really nice combination. More bushes and stuff. Especially by the wall and the water. Shouldn't all have them facing the same direction. Spin it around. Wish you could change the size on them. But can't have everything, I guess. Yeah, there'll be a pathway here. Have a couple trees. Could do beech trees even right here. I need a uh, beech seeds. You can even plant the freaking these guys. Ancient sapling, no thanks. Yeah, 
Yeah, plant a beach here because there's not really much happening in this area. Maybe even one here. Maybe put like a bit of a flower field here or something. Just for something to do. Onion seeds or what? Kind of like this, but need a lot of onions for that. Which means we need to go to the meadows base. for interior decoration so I'm gonna take advantage of the fact I've got an idea and do that now. Make a little shelf here. Put some stuff on it. Maybe potions or something. Yeah. What can we add in this corner here? It's just a wood pile, decorative wood pile. I'm not sure if that should really be indoors. Maybe like a fine wood pile. But that's more of an outdoor thing. What else can you put in here? Treasure. That's not really a spot for treasure. That wood stack looks kind of cool. It's also kind of expensive. Do a little cargo box. see the back corner. But I might just put the fermenter here, it wasn't a bad look really. Later. Yeah, just fantastic. Maybe we can sleep through it now, who knows. You are wet. Oh, let's kill Modder again. The dragon trophy. Yeah, let's go fight Modder. Get sword levels, get my dragon trophy that's gonna go in the village somewhere. Yeah, this is small intricate decorations already looking, making that look better than it was before. From them. It's a fun weapon. I'm not really using it too much this playthrough. It's too slow and dangerous. Middle mouse button is nice after Aki spin, but honestly, Mist Walker does is safer and it's better against the bugs. It has its uses though. Okay, modder. So let's get some stuff. Skipping ahead a day is good. Let the stuff grow a bit. Where is the stuff? Let's get those going. We need tasty meads. We'll be using these on the queen as well, by the way. We should actually make sure we have enough potions. We're kind of getting a bit low. Let's sort that out right now. Brew some more up. 
So we want... What do we want? We want sap. Make another pair of lingering stone meads. Make another pair of major health meads. I think I have enough tasty meads, I think. We may want yolk puffs. I probably don't have to farm these again this playthrough. I'll just harvest them now and then that's that. There's no way I'll use these up before we kill the queen. And yeah, playthrough will be over after the queen dies. But if people want me to continue, I could bring it back in Ashlands at some point, but I don't know. Maybe. Ashlands might already be out by the time you're watching this video, so... Yeah, I don't know. Let me know in the comments. I was planning to do the Battle Axe playthrough in Ashlands, though. A bit more of a chill time on normal mode. While I learn the mechanics. But a video fighting the thing I want very hard. Boss of Ash could be pretty good too. Omelettes! Forgot we even had those. We need to farm onions is what we need to do. Like we actually do need to farm onions. But not yet. Hold on. What? Honey? Cloudberries. Really? Ah! Tons of cloudberries in the uh, planes box, so it's fine. Have been. Oh, a quick step. Oh no. Right. Uh, we'll need Seeker Aspic someday. Can we make that now? It's Jibber Jabber Meat. Jibber Jabber Meat is in the Jibber Jabber box. Bam, we're already 1 hour 37. Maybe no more building and I'll go kill the queen and then finish stuff up after. I don't think there's that much to do, really. Polish up the area over there. Wait for stuff to grow. Let's go freaking mess up the queen. Let's get some secret ass speaks going. I guess I could be brewing a bit of bread while we do this. Fuck the Dragon Queen, then the Bug Queen. The ladies are gonna get it today. Come on. Wasn't there a, like a super duper food I could make with that fish I found? It would be nice if it only costed one of the fish. Where is it? Is it this? Angler fish. Let me just wiki that real quick. Valheim angler fish. Please don't tell me I need two of it. Uncooked fish and bread. I only need one. Oh. I will use this for the queen. It's the best stamina food in the game. Make use of that. Hell yeah. 
Oh, I run that with the omelet? Holy cow, we got a power combo, dude. It's pretty cool, actually. Yeah, best food in the game. I need to make sure it doesn't burn. <laughs> I'm scared I'm gonna burn it. Uh, you, you. But it's actually hard for me not to burn food, apparently. I might get raided in three seconds. If so, they can wait for me to finish. <clears throat> Come on, I've got a dragon to kill, dude. Ninety stamina, thirty minutes, dude. Hell yes. Keep that precious in there. Okay, before I do this crap, I need to farm onions. I think if I'm making a flower field, I need to start on that now. Um, there might be a box somewhere with some onions in it. Or I might have just like replanted them all. I think I've planted them all. Um, I think we're fine on like carrots and crap. Not really. Turnips, not so much carrots though. Let's just do this real quick. gonna eat one of these because by the time I fight Mata it'll be done. I can eat my good food. So I gotta go get eggs, I gotta farm. So what do we want? We want maximum onions. The 60 bastards coming up. And I are sick of your shit. Okay, good, that's done. Do we want to replant? Uh, don't think I'll need more. But just to keep them going. Yeah. Now remember, we can pull like 40 or 50 fine wood from that home base if we really have to. Dragon. Time for you to get it, and hopefully not me. These onions, just put them in the box or something. magic for eight minutes. That's a concern. What have I done? That's more like five minutes, but still, yikes. 
I hope that doesn't get me killed. Because that's not good. Stupid honey. It's a bad idea. Too stingy. Oh, look, I just woke up. It will flatten us. Yeah, lighter's required. No lighter. Yikes. Ships. Yeah, you know, wolves are pretty scary when you don't have a bubble. Okay, eggs, 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 eggs. There's an egg down there. Let's not run around with zero stamina, because I have no bubble if someone does pop pop. Like this guy. <laughs> Where did you two even come from? What the hell? Yeah, that was like some eggs right above her altar. Pretty sure. That golem is going to be uh, an issue. I'll have to get rid of him once I have a bubble ready for it. Oh, that's going to go... in an okay spot. Alright, uh, one more egg. How about the one in the rock? don't think it's back yet, but you're back. Oh, gosh. Yeah, punish uh, the wolf. Rip wolf. Um, X. Where are you going? You do you. Squawks everywhere. Kinda of need to watch my back here. Wolves and stuff, it's pretty dangerous. Without the bubble, wolf sneaks up, bite, stagger, bam, dead. Hey. Yeah. What's up, guys? Oh, yeah, I can't do that. Well, oh, damn. Yo! Tired of you. I mean, I have no way to kill her without magic. 
It's just death trying to melee that thing. I mean, I could bow it, but that's kind of boring, isn't it? Okay, here we go. Hit the bubble first. Yo! Sup? That's why we use the bubble. <laughs> Did I even put the stone golem trophy somewhere? I think it's in my bar, right? Better be. It's a very good looking trophy. Okay, Dragon Queen. Oh wait, there's another golem. Oh wait, it's uh, night time. Oh, should be right. Right, right. We're gonna pop bone mass, lingering stem me. Should be okay in theory. Prefer the portal to like not be in the way. Take that, you bastard. stuck in a hitbox. Oh yeah, good to know you can sidestep the bite. Learn something every day. Sidestep that too. to be safe. Oh. That night time's pretty done fast, what the hell? Um as long as we don't get stuck we're okay to just fly around. We have run level 90 and fen double Fenris so we're fast. With the freaking
Peter, not now. Peter? Uh, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh snap. Oh gosh. <laughs> Okay, hurry up, rain your icicles. Ah! The wolves killed it. The skeleton sorting the drake. What is going on? How did the golem lose to wolves? What is going on? Oh, there's a one star that could have been responsible. He took a hit as well. Holy cow, what is going on? Hey, mother, how you going? And I got a squawk on me. How did that not hit the squawk? That's what I want to know. Take that. Oh, I just kill one and I get another. fight is scary this fight got scary See, this is much harder than a chill yag during the day I was just bad at yag that's the problem with the wolves and shit interfering this is this is more scary than yag oh and I need to bubble badly otherwise I'm a dead man walking if I fail a roll Oh, yeah, thank you for being patient. I appreciate it. That's very considerate of you, Mrs. Dragon Man. Oh! is wearing off. Oh. Okay, you're doing that. I was going to bait out the breath attack, but if she's doing that, that's fine too. almost dead but I gotta be patient can't greed during this phase and do a bit of that though okay, focus on avoiding that it's a lot easier to avoid if you just watch the projectiles fly at you kind of It was pretty scary when the four wolves and Gollum and Drake and stuff joined in, but 
Yeah. Definitely a lot more room for stuff to go wrong than in the egg. <clears throat> and bone mass. It's probably the second hardest fight on very hard. It's like the things that join in on the egg, right, are goblins, which you can hear. Cause <laughs> so you can kind of deal with them. They're also stupid and run around. And mosquitoes, which you nullify by wearing a root vest because... Um, Biomead protects you from incineration anyway. Well, not so much on very hard, but if you ran double health food, you could take a hit from Yag. I'm pretty sure about that. It's just I choose to be a spaz. Um, okay, but let's go search for the queen. Make our way over there. We know where she is. We gotta get there though. Give me one sec, actually. Okay. I'm getting food, so AFK a bit later. <laughs> Little bastards. That's my comfort 16. Yeah. Um. All right. Our closest portal will be the Yag portal, actually. Should have left the portal here, but the eh, Yag portal should be okay. So we're gonna go to Yag Yag. Stop on my. What is it? Yeah. Not anymore. It's annoying when I have emotes randomly going off, I don't know. Um... Okay, so we'll need to cross Jibbered land. I don't know, I'll take the frost arrows just in case. I think Enris can be retired for a while. These... Uh, boats, stuff. Yeah, just take the faster. Uh, I prefer this one, to be honest. The carve, maneuverable, good for the mislands, breaking the boat is pain otherwise. We need the spare portal. Plenty of fine wood after our oak run. Blank should be linked to nothing, right? 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 Right. Yeah. Let's eat well for this journey. Dangerous journey we're going on. Got our best stuff. Let's go. I want to get lots of bio bombs for the queen. Bio bomb the babies. Fireball the jibbers. And stuff like that. Let's go this way. I prefer planes over mistlands. I think I still have bile bags in my box. Bile bomb the babies. Don't want to waste fireballs on them ideally. Um Oh, we were getting low on tar, so that fixes that a bit. 
These are nice tar pits, you just kill the blobs and you can pick up half the tar pit without having to dig a single bit. Uh, yeah. Hey, free totem there. Yeah, what was I saying? Um, Fireball the babies, fireball the jibbers, stab the queen. That's gonna be the, the plan. I really want to do this fight. If I can do the queen fight without dying them very hard, that'll be awesome. I can make a video out of that alone. Oh! <laughs> what? Oh! The village here we haven't even been to yet. Wow, this place is alive. Oh, snap. Oh, go away. Oh, there's a totem there. You guys are tempting me so much. Oh, man. You know I have to. I can't just leave a totem like that. Yeah, we can level our skills, provided we don't screw up as well. Should be good, right? Oh! Oh no, your tower! It's burning, guys! What's going on? a little guy. Uh, bye? Question mark? You good, dude? I'm over here. Sup? Oh, you got friends. I gotta be careful. Well, that's a one star who one tap my bubble. What is that brute doing? He's doing advanced tactics, so I can't ever come back if I die. It's kind of dangerous if it actually works, not gonna lie. I'm not sure what's wrong with him. He's being a real weirdo. idiots first. Okay, no bubble. Careful. Careful, Henrik. No bubble is up. It's zooming at me full speed. Oh, he's coming back! I'd really like to get a bubble up. We probably need to eat. Oh, that's unlucky. Ah, Gramps is coming. Oh, no. Q 
you in here? You're also one star. It's pretty dangerous for my bubble. Need to stay focused here. Stay sweaty. Come back, you bastard. That guy's just having a swim. Okay. My bubble back up, I think. Ha! Ah. It's always danger. Totem. Yeah, ha! Yeah, ha! The pets are coming. Who? What? My magic has gotten stronger though, because they're getting staggered at one fireball pretty consistently now. They weren't doing that at first. Holy mosquito spam, go away. Okay, two totems out of that, heck yeah. And a smashed portal. Busts. Okay, yeah, short break. Actually, I'll be back in a minute. Okay. <clears throat> Good little fueling village excursion. We may do something with these totems. All right, let's go sailing. Northwest. The wind is not looking too hot. Uh, we could go that way and run, it's looking like. In fact, she's more west than north, so yeah, we just go that way. In that case, the wind is not too shabby. Okay. And I put my boat back to front, because I'm a freaking idiot, apparently. Oh, the wind is going a wonderful direction now, it changed. Yo! Hell yeah. There's a mountain up there. Don't really need a mountain. Alright, full speed ahead! Well, actually, no, left. Yeah, she might very well be over there. We'll go land over there and run. Well, actually, we can just go straight that way. We've got wind. Hell yeah, dude. We're fighting the queen soon. Exciting! <clears throat> Then we'll polish up the building and then, yeah, conclude the playthrough. I'm gonna try really hard on this. I'm gonna get very angry if I die, so get ready for a lot of complaining and moaning and groaning if I do die. I, I know it's bad, but I can't help it. Uh, however, if we win, that'll be a mega giga chad. Very hard queen. Melee. Hell yeah. 
Just gotta remember to take it slow. Don't greed. He's a bastard. Takes a lot less damage. You know what's really dangerous? The spit. The spit will just delete us from existence. It does so much damage on the higher difficulties. The spit does nothing on normal, but it hits like a truck on very hard. I think I will root vest because I might get jibbed by little babies and without the root vest the little babies annihilate you. <clears throat> yeah, this is... I don't know if this is it. She might be here. I might have to sail again. Oh... Yeah, well... Huh. Dude, I could have left leapfrogged that without getting wet. You shut up. Forest Plains. Relatively chill biomes. And mistlands all in one? Wow, look. That's too far. Oh, for frick's sake, why now? <clears throat> I need the villagers' assistance. Like now. Guys, help me! Oh! oh. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, fight. Oh, locks appeared. Excellent. Good timing, guys. Hey, I'm out of here. Okay, you guys are my drafties. Let's go. Fight the evil wolves. Let's... Yeah, don't chomp the Henrix. Why me? Oh, stay away. Oh, God. Oh! Wolves, help me! Now there's too much planes. Oh shit, I'm in trouble. Fight each other, you idiots. Get away from me, you psychotic wolf. There's a guy right behind you, idiots. Why is with the skitter spam? Go away! Nice. Oh! There's another one! No! Get it, wolf! Oh no. Well, I survived it without popping bone mess. That's pretty good, actually. Scary. Very scary event. They are so damn fast. Oh shit, hey. Hey idiots. Oh no. Oh no.
I think I can run there. I need to go this way though. So much planes on this seat, it's insane. The amount of planes, well. More than I usually get anyway. We're in the Mistlands belt, but like... Or are we? Yeah, we easily are, but there's still so much freaking planes. The Mistlands starts like back here, but we're seeing so much planes. <laughs> I'm not complaining, it's just interesting. Good seed for totems. It's quite close. Oh, we need to go back and grab our wisp light. Tar pit and then mist. I do have a totem, but I won't. <clears throat> I'll restrain myself from getting it. Wow, she's right on the border of the plains. Right on the plains border. Wow. Okay. Cool. And drop the boat off. Okay, we want max rest of buff. We also got to deal with the idiots outside the freaking dungeon. Actually, I'll put the portal to the queen in my house, I think, so I can get rested before I fight her easily. But we need to craft bile bombs anyway. And grab the wisp light. <clears throat> Was it like resin? Was it that? Was it leather? Uh, got like 24 or something. Might be a yowl. Regular ooze bombs are also good. Tasty meads. Poison meads actually do something as well. She does do poison damage. Although I'm probably dead if I get a single hit on me. But we can bring her just in case. Well, we'll get her later. We'll get her later. Yeah. Um, sap in the box. We can use more regular ooze bombs and fairness. Like... Oh, that's poison me. Okay. Uh, ooze bombs are leather. Yuckness. And resin at the workbench. Okay, I'm scared. I am really scared. Bone mass might protect me for some of it. 
So I guess I'll rock that buff. Ah, uh, the food. Do I just eat the super good food now? We need omelets. There should be a million eggs in the chicken coop. Off this bridge. Oh. Oh. I want to go quick before the current food I have runs out. Didn't change the portal in here. Repair. So I want to refood right before the queen. Oh, when he never made the seal breaker. food is ticking. Ah, okay, that's probably not worth it. Just eat this one, or what? I'll just eat as soon as I go into the mist or something. Okay, I think we're prepared enough. Tasty meads, health meads, stamina meads. <clears throat> Eat now. And we have it for the nasty jibber jab party up the front of it. Wow, yeah, she's right on the planes. Interesting spot. That's too bad, guys. Where did the fine wood go? There's also a stompy stomp stomp down there. Jibber jabbers, right? No. Boots. 
Ah, oh, the damn tree, dude. Oh my god, move, stupid rabbit. Good, take that, you bastard. Where did you guys even come from? Even the rabbits are trying to get me killed, man. This place is evil. Oh! Okay, well, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm scared. I'm probably gonna die. I need to not get too annoyed if I die. It's really hard. We're gonna do our best though. We need to go up, is what we need to do. Because the top is way safer than the bottom. There's little babies everywhere are kind of annoying. Um We will do quite a bit of cringe gaming by running around with the fireballs. Until I get a good chance to burn her. But we gotta get rid of all this crap. Let's do some of this. Deal with the babies. That's super dangerous if that hits me. I'll probably die if it hits me. There's no surviving that. I gotta be super careful about <laughs> animation locking myself. Should have brought a demolisher. Hey, you're back. Bit hard to burn her or to melee her. These idiots on me. Yeah. It's 
so hard to melee her when I have Jibby Jabby on me. Okay, take that, you witch. Good start. She's going to start doing extra moves soon. She hasn't done Spitfire yet. costs. There it is. Row. I'm angry too, so shut up. Oh. <laughs> that was close! I didn't take a single hit though, that's alright. Babies! Let's put these guys on the... I'm not going to be using that. I'll take this, you bastard. Oh, I missed. I wanted to hit her with that. Whoa, okay. Yeah, babies can walk into that shit. I should fireball though every opportunity I get. It's so much damage. Like, look at that. 33 a second, dude. this and we go melee her for a bit. Ooh. Damn baby, dude! Baby face tanked the sword blow for uh... bastards, man. Oh, that's not good. Uh, regrettably, I should have used bone mass once I got her below 70% where she goes psycho. Now I've got little jibbers and... Bitch spray and all sorts of nonsense going on here. Come back, ma'am! Come back. Oh, babies. There she is. Good, waste that. I don't have a problem. I want to hit her. There we go. Dab! Oh, one hit from that popped my damn bubble, dude. Okay, bone mass is off. Hard mode officially begins now.
Wow, nice shot, you giga chad. Wow. It's got plenty of time on my barrier left. Hey, ma'am. Children. Oh, Need my demolisher. Uh, when I go rest again, I'll grab demolisher. That's not gonna hit me, is it? It's got a... Whoa! She flew. The spit has a limited range on it. Ma'am, come up. Wow! Coming or what? Ma'am? Ma'am! Oh, don't be like that. Got a cheeky hit on her. Oh, she's up there. Watch the spew. I'm watching for the spew crap. There it is. So we go up and fire. So I can get a bit of sorting in. I sorted her a bit there, it wasn't too shabby. So far, we're doing really well. All it takes is one F up. And Bubble can't even save you from Spew that well. I need to get out and rest in a bit. Alright, calm down. Now they'll be conga lining their way up. You can count on that. Oh. Not good. Baby! No! Bomb time for this nonsense. Ah, oh, fresh jib is wonderful. Just what we need. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, this conga line of babies, man. No.
peace. Oh, Jibba! Bad Jibba! That's a good way to bait him out, isn't it? Oh, you jibbing, you bast. You bad baby. No. Stay back. Fuck. Uh, okay. Jibber. Oh, you damn babies! Holy shit! Gotta go rest. Very good so far. Let's make this as quick as possible because. Because, 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 because. Should regen health. We don't want that. I need to grab the demolisher too. Maybe I shouldn't have bothered. Still got tons of bombs on me. Oh, where the hell? Yeah, oh, it's freaking damaged as well. Prepare the fire stuff just in case. Okay, now rest. We don't sleep because that fast forwards her regen. Lingering Stamid, I forgot about that. It's a small thing, but it adds up. Oh no. Who is she? Head right up there. Yeah, you can get out of here. Come up, ma'am. Come on, come up more. 
No, not you. Damn babies, dude. Okay, bye. That's actually a really good way to do it. Fireball the bastard, the jibber jabber bastards, and um, stab the queen. Seems super efficient. Where'd she go? Yoho! Ma'am. She burrowed down there and stayed down there. You guys shut up. Think she's coming up or what? Whoa! Jeez, ma'am, relax. Up, up, up. Come up. Come up. What is that? I'm not over there. Drunk today, man. Not now, auto save. Not now. And I've got a fight. Wow, I nailed that shot. Hit all three, all, well, both jabbers, all three shots. That was really good. Six out of six. Now we can burn her a bit. Babies move. Okay, a lot of babies stacking up. We need a bit of control in the area, I think. Double jibber. Please. Guys? Well, don't do that. We don't need those idiots coming up. No, what is wrong with you, you freaking idiot? I'm not going down there. Gosh, she's being annoying. Well, hello. Babies and friends.
Oh, that was a risky one I went for. Patience. You can sidestep that one I learned just now. Yeah, let's go! Woo! That was awesome. That was a really, really good fight. Like, a really, really good fight. Like, better than any others I've ever done. And that was very hard. Like, I basically no-hitted that. My bubble only got popped, like, once or twice. Or thrice. But I never took a single hit. That was so friggin' good. Hell yes! What a way to end the freaking series. Sure made up for my bad friggin' yag. That was an awesome queen fight, dude. Hell yes. Don't forget to like the video if you liked that fight. If you really want to help this uh, series, actually, go back to part one and make sure you've liked that, because if... Part one gets recommended, they'll watch everything else. <clears throat> but no, 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 that, that was awesome. That was really nice. Kind of gives me confidence I could do hardcore someday. Because I've definitely done Yag Deathless before. An Elder... <laughs> I died on the Elder. I didn't die on the Queen. <laughs> I've died in the Black Forest more times than I've died in the Mistlands, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> That's freaking ridiculous. <laughs> so in conclusion, Black Frost is uh, officially the hardest biome, guys. Uh, yeah. Wow. There you go. Oh, well, let's just build for a bit. That was so clean. That was so freaking clean. Oh, a wonderful fight. Mistwalker does massive damage to her, though, as you guys saw. Like, I don't think Krom is very good against her. It's too slow. You're too vulnerable. But, wow, Mistwalker, dude. 300 every time I hit the middle mouse button. Just 300, 300, 300. That just threads her health bar, even on very hard. Where you do 30% less damage. Sword skills are 49. Um, I've definitely had higher. I've gotten them to like 70 before. If you really tried with the swords, you can get them to 70 a lot faster. But this was also a pole arms playthrough. Got our magic up. I wonder what the damage breakdown was, because I know the fireballs definitely did a lot to her, but... I kind of whittled her down, but the majority of the damage, I think, was from the sword. The fireball was super effective for clearing out her babies, though, so... Pretty cool combo, like, hybrid, battle mage, sort of, melee with magic. Because we're not running any magic armor, we're not running even Ita potions, lol. But I've got the bubble, and I've got the fireball, and that's all I need. One magic food, double stam food, big stam bar, a lot of melee attacks, I can shred everything. Good for mobility, I'm not getting caught out of stamina. I did run low on stamina a little bit there, but we managed it pretty well. Ah, oh, dude, that was just an awesome freaking fight. I didn't even need my extra potions, but we'll just cook them up anyway, because why the hell not? <clears throat> Alright, I'm gonna go brag to all my friends about that, and um, be back in a couple minutes, lol. Just chill for a minute and um, then, yeah, I'll get to building. Alright, let's um, build a little more and then wrap this up, I think. Oh yeah, what a fight. Hey, my heart is over. I've got this massive kind of trench here, but it's okay. Ah, did the oak tree grow? It did. Um, that's fine. It's not flooding into the house. These ones are a bit, but that's okay. 
a very minor bit of slipping into the house. I'm sure it's fine. This looks really nice in the middle of the red flowers. Like, that looks magical, dude. Hell yeah. So, we'll do a bit more outdoor deco. Um... And then decorate the interior a bit. Then I'll repair everything for you guys to enjoy it, I guess. Although I don't know if it's really necessary, because you probably have seen the video already. I'm going to release the video and submit this build of the month. Before I release this episode anyway, so you would have already seen it. I think. Don't want to really wait until I've published the whole series. I think it's fine. Because even if I've spoiled the build a bit early, you guys get to see the queen fight on this episode nonetheless. And then, yeah, if you want to learn how to build like this, that's what these videos are for. I don't know, just thinking out loud how to do this. I don't plan my stuff out. Do I look like a guy who plans my stuff out? No, I'm a spontaneous idiot. That's how I buy it. Thread is the one who clearly organises his content very well. I do the opposite. Um... I wanted my tools. That bastard, that bastard, and that bastard. Yeah, lanterns. Let's do the lantern. Oh, why? Oh, I know. Where is it? There it is. What a queen fight. And what a great way to end the series. Oh, I'm so happy that went smooth. Good job, me. Alright. Um, 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 lanterns here. Where else? Do we, yeah, we probably want one up here, but we have to do the road for that first. Um, we've already got them all around here by the dock. I yeah, could arguably put one or two over here. Wouldn't be a bad thing, I think. Should put something here. There's not much going on, really, is there? Yeah, there should be something here. I'm not sure what, but something. I don't think it should be on that beam. It should be, like, here. really taking building to another level on this playthrough. Copper. Still got a bunch. I might want more because I'm putting this, these lanterns everywhere. I want to have them at the bridge. Shit, do I have those guys? The Virgo Lanterns? I may have to go to the Mistlands. Yeah, I've only got enough for one more. Alright, we may have to visit Baba Boba today. Because I'm not going to debug mode more in, that's for sure. Even when I stop recording. This needs to be 100% hard earned for my personal satisfaction yeah and I want one more over here but we're gonna have to after that ah, bah, bah, bah. Mm -hmm. 
Stone cutter, let's go. It's time to cut the stones, baby. Yeehaw. Okay, um, let me see. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 That's fire. That's less fire. That's even less fire. That's a trench. It's a bit steep. Let's try that. That looks good. No. Trying to get like a smooth, neat incline. It's almost good. It's pretty good, I think. Yeah, it's pretty good. That's a bit better. Oh shit, I never planted anything there. Um, right. Oh, well, we planted the onions at least, though, so we can start planting here now. I should sleep though, because it's night time in. Yeah, just sleep. Stuff grows pretty quick. Gotta go get more lanterns first anyway.
Oh, for frick's sake. I wish the rain would just completely dissolve them. Wouldn't that be nice? Ah, uh, shit. Well, I am wet, which is good. Doesn't this destroy them? Oh yeah. Oh, you stood in the water, you freaking idiot. I've got onions to gather, you idiots. Oh, the poor boars. Well, actually, we need coal, so yeah, thank you guys. It's coal delivery. Dude, what the hell? The great horse and skeletons had it coming. My fence didn't. Go, boars! Are the boars winning? No! I need to draft more boars. Squeaks! Hello! There's a neck here. Get him, piggy! No! Go, neck! Oh, they're afraid of the fire. Oh, they're both afraid of the fire. Right, they can't do damage. That's unfortunate. Bro, you're point blank. How is that not hitting? Dude. Can you go away now? Um, can I help you, gentlemen? My fence, my poor fence, dude. Got beat up pretty bad. Oh, I need to deposit. Do that in a minute.
kind of want some carrot seeds there, but I don't have many carrots left, do I? Got a few. I don't know if that's going to be enough, but... Ah! Should have planted more. Oops. Whoops. Let's see. Four left. Yeah, why not? I'm not. Well, there's more. Nice. Yeah, I'm thinking I'll put a couple in my front yard. Because I can. What about here? I'll do a few. enough <clears throat> yeah let's put some copper on still got like 20 or something don't we yeah and do stuff with that much that's that's enough to get the rest of the lanterns just, yeah, we're down to zero iron. But those are good, we're like using every single resource, apart from the tin. That's okay, tin's not hard. But we're actually like using every single resource that we have. Feels good, man. Um, right, I was evening this out a bit, yeah. Okay, so I think we can actually just go on a Mistlands expedition for a bit and find some more Tobogo Lanterns. I'm not sure how many I'm going to need. I might want some at the harbour on that side too, the wharf or whatever. Uh, so we'll go through the Queen Portal and just see about finding some Baba Bulbers. Daggity doody, babbity bulbity. And we just need lanterns, which is easy. I don't have to attack the doors to get lanterns. They're nice people and they offer them for free. We can also craft our own lanterns, but they're kind of expensive. I don't really want to do that. Let's see what we can get here. Off the lads. Might 
be one in here even? I've got a mug. There is one in here. Nice guys! Free stuff. Heck yeah. Do these give... Wish we could make these. Why not Iron Goat? I don't think he can break them. Maybe not these ones. I know there's one dwarf base that has like a keg under underground that you can break. Oh, I don't have my wisp light. What the hell? Maybe. Where's the lost baby? I think he fell out of the dungeon. No, oh, baby. Hey, uh, gentlemen. Yeah, do it, do it. Rabbit, you're gonna get a goblin hunter. Yeah. The rabbit hunters. Oh, jibs. Alright. This is a little awkward inside this super thick mist here. Um... Pretty scary, actually. This might get me killed. This, this will cut the mist actually. Forgot about that. Mist walker actually lets you walk in the mist. Yes. It's a smaller area, but it does clear the mist a bit. Actually, there's dwarves everywhere. Oh god, that's not what I wanted. No. Miss Lands is pretty scary with no the wisp light. Why the heck are the dwarves? Hello? Oh shit. Ah, uh, gyps. Oh. You pay for that, you bastard. Where the heck are Baba Bobas? One in a freaking circle. No, this is not a very big miss lens. It's insane that the Queen is even here. There's just more jibber jabbers. We got a bone. Ah! 
Here we are. Hey, this is what I need, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee yes, this is a really good one. Yes, dude. Four. Here, have uh, this bug meat. Can we go five? No. Four is really good. Just make sure there's like no mugs. Because mugs are cool too, and we want those. What about second floor? Jackadooga Barber Ball. Yes, indeed. Dude's move. Yeah, whatever floats your boat. Okay, that was easy. There we go. Bunch of lands. Done. Didn't even need Lewis White in the end. Hell yeah. These will go nice in my bar. Put them in there actually. Yeah, we can do that now. The lantern thing. Should sleep whenever we can. We've got cook copper. I'll take 12 for now. Plenty of chains. Let's sleep to fast forward the plant growth as much as possible. Should be able to sleep. <clears throat> Is that 26 episodes we're at? Is... Yeah, 26, wow. But this is it. This is the last one. So yeah, I don't know if I'm going to finish the entire thing right now. Um, I plan to just get a lot of the big stuff done right now. And then I'm going to go around and nitpick, probably repair everything and... What in the world? Oh, dude. That is a problem if they're spawning in here. It's because a campfire got removed. Yeah, there's nothing here. No workbench, no stone cutter, no nothing. Wait, there is a campfire here. So where did he spawn? Did he spawn here? Possibly. I don't know how he did that. Super annoying. Hmm. No, I was going for the lantern, the damn bastard. I wonder how he did that. How he appeared there. I think. Like, yeah, I need to fix up that building too, actually. And maybe a lantern on the chicken coop. Yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. Didn't bring enough.
Um, I only got three. Damn. Let's do the mug thing. And also take these while we're at it. Got a dump chest here for garbage. An emergency raid supplies. No. Dark Duke Babble. Need wood. Spare cups need to go somewhere. Could probably get another table here, but eh. There. Oh, I wanted one here too. We only got a few left. I need to kind of pick and choose almost. Should really have one on the chickens, I think. Yeah. Okay. I didn't do this on this side either. All this detail, it needs to happen. Getting rained on or what? No, it's just ultra fog. on that isn't so simple, is it? Ah! What to build here? Could do a little dock here. Boat house or something. Trying to get the walls up on either side so a boat can fit in here. Might actually be quite a nice look. Don't have cultivator. Uh, so where else do we want a lantern? to be honest but well, here it should be something like the wall one like this or even I think that's fine it's just annoying that the branch kind of covers it a bit yeah I might move it across just for that reason That's a bit better, you can actually like see that as you're walking up here.
What if I should get really creative and put like a trophy or something with it on each one of these? Could be a good little touch. So I've got one lantern left. One single lantern. And we probably want it at that harbour then. But there's one way we can kill the spawns, or help kill the spawns a bit. Put a workbench like here. Yeah, if we're gonna build like a boathouse or something, we should have lanterns here, shouldn't we? I think that can be today's project, final thing. Put a little boathouse here. I'll just put one here for now. Probably want two though, one on each side, ideally. A lot of this stuff can just go in the box, we just want building mats. Which is wood, tar, stone. Maybe bring this and fill it up. Bump. Oh no. Shit. And they spawn inside. Just tell me they're outside the wall or something. Sounds like they're outside. Don't know where the second one went. Shit is over there, causing all sorts of problems. Touch the wall, you damn bastards. Yes, come come here, come here, that's it. You're gonna get mosquitoed, you freaking idiot. <laughs> oh, you got it, nice. Blast what, gaming. Good, that's it. Wow. Don't come back, please. Don't like that raid, right? they're very destructive, but it's not as bad as they were bros, man. I kind of want to turn the raids off just so some disaster doesn't happen. What the hell? Right before I make a video of the base. I think I will, like we've, we've done the challenge, I mean come on, I've killed all six bosses. I'm just gonna turn the raids off just so, you know... A troll doesn't spawn inside my freaking base. Right before I'm about to video it. That would just be extremely tilting. I'll just turn it off. I'm keeping the very hard, that's fine, but... Just no trouble right now after all this work. Because it can go bad very quickly.
turn it back on when we're done building, but yeah. There's just no reason for that kind of risk. I don't know how you got out, but stray chickens aren't welcome. Yeah, Queen's dead, so like, the series is technically over. I'm just polishing stuff up. No disasters while I'm building. Okay, did I bring that cart over? Yes. I'm gonna fill it with a stone, well, not much stone that we have. Well, yeah, don't have much stone left, okay. I brought a bit of tar though, so that's good. From the tar pit. Um, yeah, I've got a decent amount. Might be enough, maybe. Try not to bump and thump our stuff as we go past. It's a bit hard with these obstructions in the way, but you know. Bridge works pretty well. Good to know. Is there a nearby stone cutter? No. Yeah, I've got to keep the campfires around just to spawn bust until I'm literally making the video, I guess. Okay, a little boathouse, I think, yes. But first we'll put some dark wood on the edge like we did on the other side. Oh wow, and I've got to finish the wall still too. Ugh. Okay. Yep. Definitely gotta do that. Um, alright, so I kind of feel like it should be a bit more out there. I think raising the ground is the easiest option. There are some big rocks out the front of the wall, by the way, that I kind of want to harvest. I want to mine them. Yeah, this grass will stick through, we can't really have that, can we?
raising it there, so all this gets ground support. I think I might consider building it out of stone. Maybe. Maybe. supported is this supported yes it's all got ground foundation support oh and I went one further here We can do that. This should be supported. Yep. Probably need to get more tar. Not much more, but maybe. Let's sleep, it's night time. Not rested. I wonder if another bastard will spawn in my shite. Start smacking my stuff. this time all right stuff is growing our final flowers yes yeah, sir just checking none of them are obstructed and stuff no nope, we're looking good all right I need to get tar so I'm gonna use quite a bit of tar on this I think Need to mine out the front. Oh gosh. Hey guys. This crap right here. been beaten to death by locks and trolls and it's pretty well camouflaged but not well enough We should be aware of. Also gives us a nice supply of stone, so hey. Greatly appreciate that right now as we're very low on stone. This rock hasn't been bashed up yet. Oh, what? Huh, what? Uh, Laters? Are you good, dude? Alright, see ya. Just in 
Okay, see so he comes back. It's a bit of rock here as well. I think that's all of it. Can I help you? <clears throat> These are too high up, I don't like it. Doesn't even need to be that high as the thing. Could just be this height instead and be a lot nicer, I think. Yeah, it's better. Ish. <laughs> stone in there. Right, we can just like find stone in like every box around the village. Like this one for example. Yeah, we're actually fine on stone. Stone is not the issue. We might have problems with tar though. Um, if I'm gonna use like dark wood arches and stuff. I don't know. I kind of just thought of this on the spot. <clears throat> I don't think 50 tar though is gonna get us through oh it's not even 50 it's like 30 so let's take our portal go to the plains there's a tar pit right outside the mistlands Just need to not get jibber jabbered. Now the planes is literally right here. Oh, these idiots are alive. Oh. Oh no, the rabbit! Don't go that way, rabbit! No! Poor rabbit is lost. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, run, rabbit! Run, rabbit! The rabbit's starting a war! Oh, the tar got the rabbit. The rabbit started the world war though. Who wins? Oh no, guys. Goblins are winning? Clubs are strong, dude. Oh no! He's stuck in the tar pit! Oh no! Oh no! He tried to have a spa and well, it didn't quite work.
find a lot of it. This last bit out. Well, maybe not. I don't know. That's if it's vanished. Yeah, if you drain the tar just far enough away, it just vanishes. As you can see, it's just like gone. It evaporates. Kind of interesting, isn't it? Good tar pit. It's um yeah, the big round one where all of it is submerged under the tar, which it gives you 110 ish. So yeah, profit. Dude, do you mind? I was gonna portal home, but I guess I won't. Huh? Busted. Yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of thinking, like, how I should do this. Should I do another episode? That's going to be very boring. No, I think I'll just edit this offline. Or, like, fin finish the final touches offline. It's just going to be tidy up and everything. You guys will, would have already seen the finished product, probably, and it's there. Um, yeah. Okay. So it could go out of stone. How big is a boat, by the way? Yeah, about that size. I should put the boat down, actually. Would probably help. Right, it's too shallow here. I'm kind of thinking I'd do this out of stone. I think it would look nice. Fine enough. Wow, 
Well, yeah, we probably want it higher. Guitar just here. Don't know how. Don't know how much. I mean, I'll need it for the roof, which is a fair amount for sure. So that's pretty well sorted. Now, I think because I have it out of wood there. That might actually support the stone. Oh. No. That's unfortunate. Oh, because I didn't do it properly. Um. Oh, I want it higher than that. Maybe I don't. Kind of annoying that sails really high, but that's how it is, I guess. Oh. What do you mean, dude? Why are you breaking now? I didn't give you permission to break. Don't you even think about being a bastard. It's a shame that it doesn't hold itself up like that. Well, I could just do a boring wooden one. I don't have the iron, actually. I can't do it out of stone. So maybe just forget that idea. That's a shame. I don't have the iron. She can't do it out of stone. Not gonna happen. Come on, stop floating. Well, okay, back to the drawing board on that one. Well, we could do stone pillars, so maybe I shouldn't have hastily removed them, as per se. Could still do stone pillars. Here or here or what? I should at least be here. And that means before, no, after the line. to sleep. Yeah, I'll build this thing and call it, I think, for the series, because all that's really left to do is the wall, which is like, you've seen most of that. It's just copy and pasting what I've already done to the rest of the wall, which isn't fully done yet. Repairing everything, and that's just freaking boring to watch. 
Um, maybe planting a few bushes here and there. I'll do the front. But, yeah. I think this is all that's really worth seeing. Okay. Also, because when I record the video, I'll probably find an imperfection somewhere, then I'll have to stop the video and then go fix it. Yeah. Um, so how do I do this? Wow, it needs to be quite high, doesn't it? The stupid boat. The boat like can't even fit in that. Can it? Actually, it should. Actually, we can. Do a traditional pivot hang. That's too high, that's unnecessary actually. Uh, it should be this high. Yeah, that works. It actually fits over the boat. Good. Yeah, it's a real shame I can't really do the stone across like I wanted to.
won't be able to do this on the other side because the stupid sail will touch it. I could even do a bit more. No, that doesn't look good. Okay, uh, this side now. So we have enough stone. We'll just work our way up. What are we doing instance wise? Still over 10k. I think it'll go to like 11k when I smash out the wall a bit more too. Is this one just not the one on top? Yeah. Oh, the hammer. Good thing we can repair in the wolf then. Nearly done this bastard. Run 92, let's go! Yeah, nearly 100, man. I didn't have a couple of those stupid deaths. Actually could have had it at 100, well. Wow. It's crazy. Uh, we played so much better when we got to the Mistlands, I feel. Much less dying. Of course, having the bubble is massive. It's so safe. Just always having that bubble on you, don't get one tapped anymore. It's so insanely overpowered. It's getting there. Do I... I think I will do this. I'll build on the edge here. Get this one. Should allow me to get up.
really need that one. some framework and uh select these bastards here bit of that No, maybe it should be a bit higher, but if it's higher, it'll touch the roof. Oh, maybe we bring this one one down and this one one up. Let's try. Don't really lose much. Whoops. Except to lose the roof. Uh, one higher like that. Yeah, yeah, I think it was that much. Yeah. So, so you can have it all the way around that way. And it comes from here, edge one. Yeah. Kind of a support layer going all the way around. And put that there without any issues. Yes, sir. No, that does not. Yeah, it works. And the bike can move around in here, so there's no reason it shouldn't be able to get through the end here. Thinking of doing a bit of framey stuff here, but it's probably not a good idea. I do want to move this boat up. Put a bit of wood here. And maybe I really should be doing that like that, eh? Oh, right as we run out of wood. Perfect. Yeah. 
kind of want more lanterns. Oops. Um, yeah, that's difficult. Really need that. Another lantern on that here, and then one coming up with this thing, maybe. I don't know, should I be doing this? Or even just off of the thing here? I think it looks nice. It's simple, but it's nice. I can't really add bars across the top as I'd like to because the stupid sail's so high. But what can you do? Bare black forge and happily pack away. That's the last of the oh no, it's not the line. All right. Well, I'm gonna put some bushes around the front of the wall to really, really finish this. What in the world is spawning? I hope that's outside. This area looks real nice. Probably grass this over. Oh, shut up. What in the well? No, my freaking flower, you goddamn bastard. Dude. Go away. Destroyed one of my things. Yeah, bro, what's funny? Who was laughing? What's funny? Die. Where'd Laffy Boy go? He's over there. There's one over way over there. Bastards.
Yeah, I'll do this. I'll do the front so you guys can see what I'm probably gonna do. Just add green to the front. And we'll mix it up a bit. Add this one here. Two bushes here. A bush here. It's got red flowers, so leave that alone. I should just cover this ugly kind of corner like that. Last little bit here. Ah, it's wonderful, isn't it? Probably gonna get bastard spawns if I remove this. It's the way of like finishing it anyway. I don't know, I might do something along here, but this outdoor restaurant and that thing over there, it's already looking pretty good. There's no point in repairing stuff while it's stupidly raining. I'll keep those there so I can repair next time. But we are done. What's left? Could plant a few more of these around. I guess I could put trophies on them. 
Haven't thought much about that. Yeah, it looks gorgeous with all the different colour flowers. And we've got lots of patches of the pretty red ones as well. Good value out of those. This part is kind of ugly. It almost terraformed this a little bit. And get this part submerged. Oh, for freak's sake, where? You damn bastard! Arrgh! That's messed up, dude. He almost got me as well. Wow, dude. You're freaking killing my barley. You grow barley too. To be honest, I could replant these very neatly. So a small minor change I might do. Uh, there's stuff spawning in this area somehow. Who knows how the hell that's happening. Which spot is not spawn busted, but... Bloody hell, that's annoying, isn't it? Uh, it's because I got rid of one of those campfires, and it's killing me. That's crazy, because there's a workbench right here as well. Like, where are you coming from? Are you spawning right here or something, or what? Somewhere right here. There's a workbench! Like, huh? Ah, there's a campfire here! Where are you spawning, you rotten little bastard? I don't get it. Oh yeah, it's great, because now I have to go bring the freaking Black Forge over to repair my stuff. Oh, that's annoying. Anyway, well, he did kindly remind me I need to harvest my barley and plant it nice and neatly. Those are the small optimizations I'm going to do off the video, essentially. No. 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 I'll just get this freaking thing here to spawn bust. I guess until I'm actually ready to hit the record button. Put a couple of those certling uh, trophies around, maybe. Real, real quick. Oh, 
I don't know about having them on an X. Maybe like that. That way they're lower down. No, I have the rest of them somewhere. One of my many boxes. That are like all over the place. There's two in here. There must be more. Who knows where the hell they are. Let's do them that way though. Really? That seems to be a really good way to do them. Better. Looks like the fire's coming towards you a bit. Bridge looks great. Yeah, I think that's a better one, better way to do it. Although this one kind of works. Don't really need it right next to the lantern. Go around and clear the workbenches later. Stop raining, bastard. Hey, listen to me, thank you. Should I get a fence on this side? Maybe. It's fairly unnecessary though. Yeah, look how gorgeous it is. Okay, quick repair round, maybe. Very quick. Just to get an overview. You see how annoying this is? Now we gotta move the forge.
West Pad is gonna get onto the freaking roof of this bastard. It's probably gonna break. One hammer. You can do it, hammer. Yes, the hammer survived. Hell yes. Nice. Ugly ladders be gone. What is that? I don't think that's supposed to be there, is it? Ah, oh, I gotta go up there to get it though. No. Dude. This box, well, yeah, goes into our internal storage here. Yeah, by the time the rain finishes, it's already freaking night time. Grr. Oh, I get to see the city in action at night, I guess. So we're done. That's it. No grass I need to remove. No, this, this part is like 100% done and it looks freaking amazing. Uh -oh. Thank you for watching until the very end. Those of you who did, you are absolute legends. I hope everyone enjoyed the series. This definitely won't be the last one. Nice mix of very hard combat and very intense building. Um, just had a lot of free time and yeah, thought I'd go to town with it and this is by far the most amazing thing I've ever built, so heck yeah dude. And that will be all. Make sure you've liked and you're subscribed to the channel so you don't miss more and see you on the next one.